Hey, what is up, guys? Skelified here, and we are back with some more My Hero Season 2, Episode 7. We are catching on with the one on one battles. First one up is Deku versus Hitoshi Shinso, who got Deku already, I guess, in whatever his quirk is. Um, it seems to, like, make people forget what's happening. Because, like, even, I, th I believe it was his two, two of his teammates dropped out of the 1v1 tournament and two for, uh, members of Team 5 got put in instead. But I don't know what we're doing here. Because, like, Deku's already got... I don't know if he's going to be able to get out of this because I was really hoping for to see that Todoroki-Deku fight. But I, I don't... I'm, I genuinely don't know if Deku's going to pass this or if it's just going to be, like, his first obstacle to overcome... Hopefully, because I would really, again, like to see that Todoroki-Deku fight. Um, we got a little bit more backstory on Todoroki last episode as well with his father and the quirk marriages, and they touched a little bit on that. Um, but yeah, no, very excited. I just kind of want to hop right into this because one-on-one -on -one battles in anime are the absolute best, and I, I really just want to see how this goes. I hope Deku just won for all this mofo, and we... we keep on with the tournament i hope we get to see every match up that would be nice because it's only 16 people so it should only be eight matches in the first round so i wouldn't mind spending a good chunk of the season two on this tournament which again don't know if we're gonna but hopefully we will but uh yeah um every link in the description go click that discord like the butt like the button hit the like button for the video subscribe if you haven't hit that bell so you get notified when all these videos come out they come out at 11 a.m anyway but it helps out if you hit the bell anyway because like more people will see the videos and then it gives me more of an incentive to make keep making them um but yeah discord all that podcast will be out saturday first episode hopefully you guys check that out um I'll, I'll update with that on discord as well so make sure to go follow me over there and uh yeah Episode 7 of Season 2, My Hero? Let's get into it. Out of bounds or mobilize them? Ooh, I didn't even realize that you could force them out of bounds. That's probably a good, good rule to remember. But can he make him say I give up with all this, like with his quirk or whatever? I feel like this is a very manipulative quirk that shouldn't be what a hero has. I still can't believe Deku talked after being told not to respond to him. <sighs> He's confident that he already won, so I'm not really sure. His eyes are like dead white too. Maybe he's like playing him or something and he got like earplugs in or something. <laughs> Could he actually be someone worthwhile? Victory or defeat? Oh god. That's one hell of a title. He can actually just control him with this. <laughs> Wait, that's ridiculous. How do you... Is there no way to break it? Brainwashing? That's quite ridiculous. Answering his question. So he has to answer a question. Oh, okay. So you can just... Oh, wow, okay. That makes sense. But he gotta break this, right? But can you do that? Is that like a possibility? All Might's gotta like yell to him and break it, right? Someone gotta yell out to him to wake him up, right? Oh, he can, he knows it's happening. That has to be a ridiculous feeling. 
not being able to control what you're doing. Yeah, you still did it. Flashback to Ojiro talking to him. If you knew this much about it, why would you answer the question? But how would you, how would you, how would you know this and still mess up? So if you take physical damage? Huh. Alright, you got people relying on you. This is, this is when one for all works best. Come on, man. Come on, you fist bumped with the dude. You can't lose like this. Come on. There's no way, right? He's so close to the edge. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. What in... His whole body's one for all. It's gonna shock him out of it. Which is what? Oh no. He's gotta turn around. One for all is activated. Come on. He, okay, he broke it. Let's go. So close. Holy hell. Did he break his fingers? That's gnarly as fuck. He destroyed his own two fingers to break it? Damn, that means he's gonna be he's gonna be weak against Todoroki. Yeah, don't answer. Don't answer. All the people who've previously had it? Don't speak, just kick ass. Kick ass, take names. Yeah, he, he, yeah, this man has never had a quirk until now. He, he wasn't born with a quirk, buddy, old pal. Damn, he's not even, like, fighting back. Never mind. That... Bro, he's just gonna chuck him out of the arena. Holy arm drag! Bakugo even's impressed from that. That cement and has to hurt like fuck. Did he just break the dude's back? Oh, okay. I, I didn't know if he like just kinda killed the dude. Cause like getting dropped on cement like that is not good at all. But hey, Deku wins. Let's go. Three years ago. Wait, what? This is an odd time. Naboo. Oh, I heard that they put a lot of Star Wars references in here, which is funny. Cause we've already had Dagobah and now Naboo. Atta boy. That's my boy. Bro, Bakugo's gonna absolutely destroy <laughs> Yuraka. Yes, he did. <laughs> and it was very good. He does love the arm drag. That was a boring first match. <laughs> Bullshit. I do feel bad for dude, though, if he is genuinely trying to be a nice guy. Yeah, you're gonna answer his question now. Mm. 
I, I do like how they did that. That was basically kind of like someone similar to Deku. Granted, he did have a quirk, but... <laughs> Almost just hit him straight in the... Oh. Eight or nine people. Okay, maybe there's more about that than we know. <sighs> Were you not watching? Oh, Endeavor's coming to give his son a pep talk. The bro, Todoroki is pissed off. And it seems like his dad's power is probably the stronger one, too. That's maybe just combining them to both work is better than either or. Oh no. Yeah. There is not much you can do against this man. Homie, you overdid it! She even froze her! I like how she had to ask because she couldn't get over there to move or to check herself. You think? At least he can use his dad's side. <laughs> Were you now? Good god, Deku's fucked. <laughs> Deku is fucked. <laughs> well, technically he isn't using his dad's power for that. Yeah, because he's using his dad's power. His dad's power, probably. Granted, he didn't use it for the fight, but he used it for the melting of the ice, which I guess isn't as big of a deal, and he didn't really promise that, but he still probably doesn't like using that side because of whatever his dad put his mama's family through. But good god, okay. Well, we got our two two of the fights, the two with the main strongest two people, I guess, besides Bot. I guess... At this point, I'd say Deku is stronger than Bakugo just because it's one for all, and if he ever does use 100% of it, he's probably going to kill whoever he needs to fight. But Todoroki, <laughs> Todoroki is broken. He definitely needs a nerf or something. I don't know. That man, he like, he froze this judge in half. He froze half of the arena. Whereas Kamui Woods and the other dude were able to see it from outside the arena. And the arena is not small. It's a pretty big arena. But I, I don't. Like, I know Mans doesn't like his dad and all, but he went overboard in a half. Sheesh. I don't. Victory or defeat. The, that, that man was far from a defeat. I, I don't know how Deku's beating this guy in the second round. Because it is... Deku versus Todoroki in the second round, and oh, good God, that's that's gonna be a rough one. There, there's no way, there's no way Deku's winning. I don't think. I think this is where they have to like give Todoroki the win and give Deku the okay, I need to get stronger moment. Because if Deku finds a way to beat Todoroki, I will be very, very surprised. Oh God, um. Bakugo is gonna kill Yurata, Yurata, or she might even just give up. Um, and we have a four more after that, or five more, including Ida's fight, which I forget who Ida's matched up against. Um, the main other thing, though, I guess from this episode is the whole Deku seeing the other, presumably seeing the other people from One for All, um, when he was doing, and that helped him break his fingers so that he could break out of the brainwashing from Shinso. I don't know whether or not to believe All Might on that, because All Might seemed like he was being honest, but then at the end there, he was like, when she's, when the healing lady 
said, "Oh, well, she saw you. He saw you in there." He's like, "Good." Like, I don't know if that just means that All Might left. Like, that means All Might's power is in there, or if there's something other other meaning behind that, which is more important that he just didn't feel the need to tell Deku yet. That maybe Deku shouldn't know or doesn't want to know. I can't see All Might doing anything to harm Deku. But maybe it's just something he feels like he doesn't need to know right this minute. Which would be better than him just being evil and turning on Deku, which I think would just be out of left field. But anyway, very much enjoy this. I'm excited to get on to the rest of this tournament, because tournament arcs are the best. 1v1 tournaments arcs in anime specifically are the best. And uh, yeah, um, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.